Good morning and welcome to Barco's One Campus for today's exclusive ClickShare CSE 800 launch. I'm Angela Lamont, tech presenter and broadcaster, so I'm as curious as you are to find out what this new product is all about. Now, I'm sure you've used one of these before. So instead of wrestling with cables, or if you're like me and you're a Mac user, wrestling with adapters and cables, you just plug this in, click the button, and there's your presentation on the screen. I'm here today to meet the experts and get a demo of the latest addition to the ClickShare family. So do send your questions through to the chat room and I'll try and get those answered. And also remember there's a live Q&A at the end as well. And now I've got someone with me who's been there right from the beginning with ClickShare. It's Levin Berthier. Hi, Levin. Hi, Angela. How are you? So tell me a bit about how ClickShare came about in the first place. I'd love to. So ClickShare, and that won't be a surprise, was born out of frustration. So Barco, an AV company, we are uh, providing all kinds of equipment. And we realized when we go into meetings, we are struggling to get on screen. And then you start talking with people outside of the company, business professionals, meeting room users. And all of a sudden, you see a pattern like everybody is struggling to go on screen. They have adapter pieces, but they don't know how to use them. They miss them, etc. And that's how ClickShare got born. OK, so how is meetings with this little device? How does that, that make it better? Yeah, well, this, this little device, if I may, it's the most iconic part of the ClickShare system. It's called the ClickShare button. And it embodies the value prop of ClickShare, which is connect, click, share. Three easy steps. You plug this into the USB port of your computer, you wait for the client to load, you click, and you go on screen. That's as easy as making a cup of coffee. That's what ClickShare does. And it is very simple, but you've got it now, and it works. So why add another product onto the range? You're right indeed. So today already we have more than 200,000 meeting rooms equipped with, uh, with ClickShare, with two models mainly, the CS100 and uh, the CSE200. But we felt the need to further expand the portfolio. Let me explain why. So if we start with the CS100, the one we are seeing here, this one allows to, to, for one user to go on screen. And as such, it's, it's the true ClickShare value prop. It's, it's ClickShare to, to, to its purest essence. Why do I say that? Because you put this unit in a meeting room, a huddle room, or, or a meeting room in a small business. There is an auto-update function. Whenever there is new functionalities, the unit will automatically update itself. So cable replacer, uh, that's what the CS100 brings. If we move on to the next room, uh, and this is actually our high-running product, this is the CSE 200. This one allows for two people to be simultaneous on screen, but it also has a lot of extra features targeted at enterprises. We call this an enterprise-grade product. What do we mean with it? First of all, it brings more security, more, better encryption. Uh, next to that, it also brings a lot of integration options. And last but not least, this one also brings a lot of BYOD options. It comes with AirPlay, it comes with Google Cast, it comes with support for mirror up. so that means you can use any device you want to use there. Okay, so let me guess, CSE 800, eight users on screen. You're spot on. <laughs> Indeed, the 800 is about bringing eight users simultaneously on screen, but at the same time, it's also an enterprise product, so everything I said about the 200 is also present on that product. But there's a lot more, so let's go and have a look. Okay. Sorry, folks, to interrupt, uh, but I hope I can steal one minute of your time. I would like to show Angela the CSE 800 in action. And here it is. Um, and there's a lot of you, if you don't mind me saying it. <laughs> How many people can connect to the 800? Up to 64 people can actually connect to the unit. So the unit's been designed for use in large meeting rooms, for use in boardrooms, C-level suites, where you have a lot of meeting participants. And of those 64 connected, up to eight can go on screen if you have a dual screen setup. In this case, we only have one screen, so you see four sources can go on screen at one given moment. And I can see the buttons around, so it's the yep. same button that's used. It's the same characteristic ClickShare button. It's the same ClickShare experience that, uh, that people are used to. It's, uh, it's about BYOD, it's about security, it's about integration, all that kind of stuff. But the CSE 800 also brings three extra elements. 
The first one is it has legacy inputs. That means you can bring in other sources if you want. And in that way, you no longer need the basic switch that is very often present in this kind of meeting room. So this is about saving money. This is about having a great total cost of ownership for the product. Secondly, it also comes with blackboarding and annotation. That means you get a degree of interactivity that was until now not present on ClickShare products. And last but not least, there's also a moderator option. So that means if you don't want to use the auto layout function, you can have somebody control the meeting. Okay, and the, the same lack of cables and hopefully lack of faffing around. So that all sounds good. Thank you very much for that. I'm going to say thank you for letting me interrupt your meeting and I'll see you later. Thank you. So I get the need for the bigger CSE 800 now for meetings with lots of complexity and lots of people and expensive people at that. I still want to get my hands on it and see what it can do. So let's go for that demo. Hi, Michael. Hi, Angela. This is Michael von der Heeren, who's the product manager for ClickShare. Now, I've just been talking to Levin mm -hmm. about the CSE 800. OK. But they wouldn't let me play with it. So I've come to you to get a look. That's a pity, but luckily we got it here in this meeting room. So welcome to meeting room Bangkok uh, within the Barco headquarters. We have a nice setup with a CSE 800 here and two 4K screens which are connected to that. So that actually allows us to share with up to eight people at the same time on the screen. And whether you're sitting close by or a bit further, you will see a very crisp image and a good resolution actually. And the second thing we have here in this meeting room is legacy sources. So we have a camera here, but whether it's a camera, stationary PC, a document camera, Blu-ray player, you can connect it via HDMI into the CSE 800 and without any hassle it can come on screen automatically into the composition that you normally have. So all of that together with the general ease of use you have of ClickShare that you're used to for any user here. Well, that sounds good. Can I have a go? Of course you can. Thank you. So what do I do? Just plug in? Yeah. If you find a free USB slot, you plug in the button there. You wait a minute until the LED is uh, fully white. And at that point, you can either do just one click to come into the composition. But now the composition is full, so maybe you can take over. And to do that, you just do a long press and everyone is then off screen and you will be the only one who will be on screen with your content at that point. Seriously, I can kick everybody else off? Yeah, you can. OK, sorry about this. Now it's ready. So you can do your long press. And there we go. Yeah. Well, sorry for kicking everybody off, but that looks great. Um, and then just run the presentation yeah. as normal. So whether you have a Windows PC or a Mac, just plug in the button, connect it, tap on the button, and you can start your meeting right away. So no hassle with any cables on the desk, uh, no technical issues, so your meeting starts on time. I have to say there is an amazing lack of cables on the desk, and that was incredibly easy. A little bit too easy, so mm -hmm. I'm just going to give you a challenge. OK. I brought my phone with me. Yeah. Can I get on the screen with my phone? Yes, you can. And it's a trend we see uh, quite often now in meeting rooms. So people bring in their tablets or an iPhone um, and they come into the meeting room. They don't bring their laptop anymore and they want to get on the screen to present something. So with the ClickShare, we also bring bring your own device support. So whether you have uh, an Android or an Apple uh, uh, phone, you can just use the ClickShare app, you can use MirrorUp, which is a protocol we, su we support, AirPlay or Google Casts. AirPlay I've got. That's perfect. So if you look into the Wi-Fi settings of your iPhone, yeah. and then you connect to the ClickShare uh, Bangkok. So C is Bangkok is a Wi-Fi. Um, Bangkok. There you go. Yeah. So now I suggest that you find some content that you want to share but on screen. It. OK. Yeah. So I took a lovely photo of Neil the cameraman okay. earlier when we were setting up, so... Swipe up at the bottom, and there you have AirPlay. Oh, meeting room, Bangkok. Yeah. OK. And there's Neil, star there of the it. show, yeah. Neil. Fantastic. And then I can just turn it off. Yeah, so getting off screen is as easy as uh, getting on screen, actually, with AirPlay. So whether you have a phone, tablet, 
uh, bring in your laptop, everyone can get on screen. Up to 64 people can actually connect and aid sharing at the same time. So that kind of begs the question, what IT support do you need for ClickShare? Very little, actually. So IT can use our ClickShare management suite, and that's actually a central management suite that they run on a computer. And they can see all the ClickShares within the end, so the enterprise ClickShares within their corporate environment on there. So they get a big list of all the ClickShares there, their status, so they can update it, configure them, change the wallpaper, the meeting room name, and go ahead and check it out. So they don't have to walk around all of the building to update them, to change something. They can do it at their desk, basically, which is very simple. And is installing it a big deal in the first place? No, not at all. So a lot of people either install it uh, below the desk or in the ceiling. But this unit, the CSE 800, is actually rack mountable. And for big boardrooms like this, this is actually ideal. So it takes up one unit in your rack space. You just screw it in there and it's done. You connect the cables and it's nicely fit in there and it's clean. So with this, you can have eight people on screen at one time, but you can have 64 people sharing. Is that right? Correct. That kind of begs the question, especially at boardroom level, mm -hmm. about security. Is yeah. it safe to share with that many people who may be from different companies? So with the new click share range, we actually thought about security a lot. So within the button and the base unit, there is a certificate, a barcode certificate, so no one can come in with a fake button or a fake base unit and act like it would be a barcode unit. So we know how to identify button and base unit. That's one part. The second part that we have is actually three different security levels. So the three different security levels can be used by any environment you have. So if I'm in banking and government, maybe I'll choose for the third security level and then AirPlay won't be possible. So certain features are locked down at that point. If you go to the second security level only, when you would be sharing with AirPlay, for example, you would have to enter an additional passcode before you can get on screen. So that makes sure that you are in this room and see the passcode before you can start to share. And the last part we have, and that's only for the CSE 800, is dual network integration. So you have two Ethernet connectors in the back, and you can put it in your guest network and your corporate network at the same time, but it's separate. So traffic doesn't pass through there. So it's got greater security, mm -hmm. the CSE 800, but what about features for the people who are actually in the meeting room? What can they do? Well, for the first time with ClickShare, we're actually bringing moderation as well to the meeting room. And we do that because you can connect with up to 64 people at the same time and share with up to eight. So you want to keep the meeting still focused while you're doing that. And so, Johan, you can start the moderation by just right-clicking on the click share icon in your system tray and click on start moderation. Is this to stop people like me pressing the button and throwing everybody Complete, out? Completely correct. <laughs> so it limits the functionality of every button to just signaling you want to be on screen. So Johan is now in full control of what you actually see on screen. So if some of the people here would like to press in with a button, Johan gets a nice overview of all their different sources. Okay, so I can see the screens are appearing there, but yeah. they're not appearing. Oh, they are now that Johan... And that's because Johan is actually selecting which source he wants to see on which screen. The layout is something he doesn't need to care about. So it's really about selecting which content you want to discuss during the meeting and not about jiggling around with all the screens. So all the hassle of having a control panel on your uh, meeting room table is actually gone with this because you just need to plug in the button, which you anyway do during the meeting, and you can start the moderation client from there. No installation needed, nothing like that. Very, very easy and convenient. And the second part we have is actually blackboarding and annotation. And I'm going to show you that. If you have some content like this here, and this is a touch screen, I just touch it with more than one finger. And now I get a menu where I actually can select between blackboarding and annotation. So I take annotation. It's very easy. You can just touch and scribble around. So there's no need for training with ClickShare. Requires minimal support. You just scribble around here. You can change pen sizes, erase, change colors. And the nice thing is I can also save. You don't need USB sticks for this, and you also don't need to email the files around. Anyone who has a button connected here, and actually quite a few of us have connected the button, if I press the Save button here, they will get the file automatically. So if you're in a hassle at the end of a meeting and you want to take a run for it, 
press the save button and within a few seconds everyone has the file. It's as simple as that. Very easy, very convenient to do. So if you've got 64 people connected, even if you've only got, say, five of them on the screen, if you save that, all 64 people... Everyone okay. who is connected will get the file, correct. Cool, thank you so much. No problem at all. For that demonstration. And I'm thank sure you. we're starting to get a lot of questions in. Yeah. Let me just have a look. Yes, we are. So can you come downstairs and join us and help to answer some of those questions? Yeah, of course. I'll and I'll meet you down there in a few yeah, minutes. Perfect. Brilliant, thank you very much. So all of that seemed to work pretty well. Um, seems to be pretty much plug and play, as promised. Um, I really get the lack of IT support needed, which also, of course, reduces the amount of time spent hanging around waiting for the IT guy thing, which is really important when you've got as many people as they had up in that meeting room there. And um, Michael didn't even seem to mind when I added my phone to the mix, and that seemed to work all right as well, which is good news. So, guys, we've had some questions coming in already. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> Michael, you're not going to like the first one, but I'm going to ask it anyway. Okay. Um, it was, did you fix the extended desktop with ClickShare? Uh, good question. We had already support on Windows 7 for uh, extended desktop, and our team is currently working very hard on supporting also Windows 8 and Windows 10 by a driver that will be, uh, will be installed when you install also the ClickShare launcher. So then you will have that capability on the CSE 200 and the CSE 800. And for Mac users, there's always the AirPlay functionality in the Mac OS X that they can use to use extended desktop. OK, and I, I like the AirPlay, tried the AirPlay. So hopefully that answers your question. Um, we've got a question for you as well, Leven. Well, several questions really about um, justifying the cost of buying the CSE 800 and how you kind of get that investment back? Yeah, so the ROI question, let's yeah. say. Yeah. yeah. OK, I think with, with the CSE 800, you will see ROI on, on three different levels. First of all, there is uh, the fact that your knowledge workers, they, it will be easier for them to share information, to exchange knowledge. It's, it's lowering the bar for uh, information exchange. So in the new way of working, that will definitely give, give some extra results. Next to that, there's also uh, the TCO side of things, because uh, with its price point of uh, 5,000 euros or US dollar, uh, the CSE 800 replaces uh, a lot of components in the meeting room. So it is uh, really value for money that you are getting there. But the most important argument, I would say, is, is what customers also report. We have customers saying that they've reduced the number of uh, IT interventions with 50%. And if you know that an IT guy runs a marathon on average every year from meeting room to meeting room to support people, I'm sure you'll agree we'll be saving them a pair of shoes every year. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, thank you so much for answering our questions. My pleasure. Thank you very much. Pleasure. You're not done yet, though, because you're going to go and log on and, yeah. and answer some questions in the chat room, aren't you? Okay, We're ready. Brilliant. So, Michael and Levan are going to come and log on and answer your questions. So, get those questions coming into the chat room. As you can see, we've got some of the rest of the ClickShare team already here answering your questions as well. And they'll be here for the next few minutes, making sure that yeah, they've answered all your queries. So, log on, and I hope you've enjoyed the demo.